Alright everyone, welcome back to another video of how to train your dragon 2. I'm just testing the last how to get one of the secret dragons, which is the stoic dragon. Now the only thing I've done is mountain of fire, I'm melf on fire, as well as fearless rider. That one was a given. If you're swinging around, you'll probably get 100% too. Alright, so we're going to dive down and try to look for Stoic. If I remember correctly, the cave should be over here. Ooh, oh, what a dodge. Alright, it's right there. Alright, there it is. There is Stoic. Essentially, what happened was the first time I did it, I thought you need to complete Toothless's quest. And then, now I'm doing it again, right in a brand new game. Which is pretty crazy already. Alright, Toothless token is still here. What you need to do is melt on fire. That's what you need to do. Light up all the statues. It took a really long while to find them all. I might include them in the video if I am able to cut them out. But we'll see. Let's get stoic and then we'll talk more about that. Fire, bud! Alright, Toothless! Alright, there it is. Stoic and Skull Crusher. The hidden secret dragon in How to Train Your Dragon 2. Let's just go in here and take a look at it. Alright, there he is. Stoic, Skull Crusher, the Dragon. Alright, let's go use him. And yeah, that's how you get him. Wow, look at his blast. It's pretty crazy. Pretty dark, darkish kind of blast. Let's take him down! So, it has like red, no wait, it has orange and yellow aura. And then it's surrounded by black, which is really cool. Let's turn around and dive down a bit. So that's how he dives, and that's how he stops. So that is how you get Stoic and Skull Crusher in How to Train Your Dragon 2. Alright everyone, so luckily we're gonna do this first in the beginning where the villages there's there's a statue there you can shoot I don't remember exactly where everyone is but this is in between the two mountains at the bottom you'll notice there's two mountain there it's in between the two icy mountain, except it's right at the bottom. It's either on the left side or the right side, but you get, you'll get you have to check on that. It's not that hard to spot, let's just say that. Okay, we're going to move on and then check out the next location. That was the second one. Alright, inside the cave, you know where the fireflies are, if you, could, if you call these things fireflies. I don't know, they look like... Um, they look like paper, but anyways, inside there's a statue for you to, for you to flame up. Up next, we're gonna look at the fourth one. Alright, this one is all the way to, it's on one of the islands, right there. Alright, Toothless! 
You also notice that there's a lot of other mountains, especially that circular mo mountain, or I mean not mountain, but place. But moving on near the sea, right there. There's a lot of stuff here. And now this one, I've actually looked at the map for you, if you want to check that out. That's because I wasn't planning to do a video showcasing where you find all these statues. But decided to do that just to help you out. Or make it easier for you anyways. Because it took about like two hours to find them all. Alright, one in the icy mountain. This one took a really long time to find. Oh boy. But luckily we were able to find it. And if you are wondering, I did start a new game just to find out how to get Stoic 100%. And then, of course, we had to run around looking for the statue. No, another like two to three hours. But yeah, this is a brand new game. And we're going to look at the last statue and where to find it. Alright, right there. This one was difficult. It's hidden between the trays. So it's like somewhere in the clouds, right there. It's on the left side of the first icy mountain. And there it is. All right, toothless. <laughs> all right, so that's all the mountains. And then you can go into a cave and then look for stoic.